that what is input, what is processing and what is output. So let's revise, okay? As you know, when we enter the pencil in the sharpener, this process is called input, okay? And when we sharpen the pencil, this process is called processing. And when we found a sharp pencil, this process is called output, okay? And the whole cycle, when we enter the pencil in the sharpener, we sharp it and we found the sharp pencil, the whole cycle is called IPO cycle, okay? The whole cycle is called IPO cycle. Clear? I means input. I means input and P means processing. I means input, P means processing and O means output. Okay? I stand for input, P stand for processing, O stands for output. So, is it clear? What is IPO cycle? Dear students, tell me one thing. What is in my hand? This is a whole computer system, right? This is the whole computer system. You can see that this is monitor and this is keyboard, mouse, speaker, printer, CPU and microphone. Okay? This is microphone. So, students, in the computer system, there are four types of devices. The computer system devices are divided into four parts. Number one, input device, input devices, number two, processing device and number three, output devices and number four is storage devices. Number four is storage devices. CPU is a processing device. 
So the processing device is CPU. Okay. And what you see? Next, left in the monitor you see printer. So what is the use of printer? Printer gives us printouts. Okay, printouts of our data. So it is also an output device. So printer is an output device. The last device is the storage devices. So can you tell me which device is storage device in the computer system? Which devices that you see in the picture are called storage devices? As you know, there are so many parts in computer system. As like monitor, keyboard, printer, mouse, speaker, microphone and many other devices. Okay, these parts are divided into two parts. Number one is hardware and number two software. Which part of computer we can touch or feel is called hardware. As like monitor, keyboard, mouse, speaker. Microphone are, is called hardware, okay? And which part of computer we cannot touch or feel is called software. Hardware, right? Monitor. Keyboard. And etc. And what is software? Software is a program, okay? All programs that we install in the computer are called software. Okay, programs that we install in the computer system are called software. As like Notepad, WordPad, MS Paint and many other programs, okay? You know that some of body parts like heart, liver, lungs, stomach are found inside our body. Similarly, some are hardware parts of computer system are found inside the CPU box. As like motherboard, SMPS, microprocessor, hard disk drive and RAM. Again, number one, motherboard. Number two, SMPS. Number three, microprocessor. Number four, Hard disk drive number 5 RAM. These are the four hardware that are found inside the CPU box. In today's class, we have learned about what is input device, what is processing, what is output, and what is storage device. And we also learned about the parts of computer that is hardware and software. Today we have learned about the detail of hardware. Okay students, in the next class we will learn about software. Okay, so we will meet in the next class. Bye-bye.